life is about courage and going into the unknown. Dude, hey man, where are you now? Himalayas. I'm not gonna keep this short. I have to make oxygen choices. In 1947, Danny Kaye starred in a film called The Secret Life of Walter Mitty, and it was from a short story by James Thurber. It's wildly different than the new version here in 2013, which has taken many, many, many years to being remade as a Hollywood film. Finally, Ben Stiller cracked the code. He directs it as well as stars in it, and it is wildly different. This is a contemporary take on the fantasy life of a guy who's going through a midlife crisis. He's about 40 years old. He works for Life Magazine, as Life Magazine is just about ending its run. In his work life, he's always fantasizing about what he'd rather be doing, that he's missed his lot in life, that he's not met his potential. The ice, Jace, she moves like a woman. I'd like to climb your hair. Oh, wow. You know, he has got a vivid fantasy life, and that's the problem. Well, this movie is different than the original because it takes off on those fantasies and actually makes them come true. He actually winds up going on an adventure of his own, way away from his comfort zone, and uh, that's where the movie really becomes an exciting thing to watch. There's a fin here! You are safe! Ah! That's a shark! That's what I said! Ben Stiller's really good in this. It's much better than his recent films. He has not had a great run of it in the last couple of years. Although, I remember the last film he directed was a masterpiece of comedy called Tropic Thunder. This is a wildly different movie in terms of its tone. It's more serious. It's not like knock down, drag out funny, but it's always entertaining. This is actually Ben Stiller's triumph, I think, in a lot of ways. <laughs> The cast also includes Kristen Wiig of Saturday Night Live fame and of course Bridesmaids. And uh, she also plays it kind of very serious too. Shirley MacLaine shows up for a couple of scenes as, as uh, Stiller's mother, as Walter Mitty's mother. The movie itself has one truly great performance. Two-time Oscar winner Sean Penn, and I don't think he's been better on screen in a long, long time. I highly recommend the movie though, overall. I think you'll have a good time. It's a, it's a Christmas holiday treat from 20th Century Fox, go.